happy friday i hope you're doing well welcome to another vlog this vlog is going to be all about me getting ready for my trip to peru i am flying out on sunday i'm definitely very stressed i am getting ready to go get my pcr test i also have to buy a few things by the way i forgot to say i did my braids these are my braids they're all the way down to my butt once i do my makeup and i look all put together i'm sure they'll look a lot better but right now, I'm just getting ready to go to my appointment, so let's go. Hey y'all, happy Saturday. It's day two of me getting ready for this trip. It's already like two, I believe. Yeah, it's 2.05. I'm getting ready to head into the city and run some more errands. But this morning I waxed my armpits and I shaved my legs, so that's good. I have to go to Best Buy to pick up my drone today and I have to also pick up a few SD cards. And I need to get a travel size toothpaste because all of my toothpastes are really big and I'm traveling with a carry-on only. And I'm going to show you a little bit later how I pack what toiletries i pack and, and i need to print my pcr results i actually got the results the same day i did the test so if you live in new york city and you need a pcr test and you have less than 24 hours before your flight definitely go to nyu shameless plug that's also my alma mater <laughs> um but anyways y'all i actually got a few things on asos and i'm gonna show you what i got some of them are not even for peru but i'm gonna show you everything i got anyway i got these espadrilles i've never owned a pair of espadrilles but i saw these on asos and they look really nice and i heard they're supposed to be really comfortable for walking so i'm bringing these to peru and i think they just look so cute i also got a little anklet yesterday and yeah i love the whole 
look of these with my anklet and everything honestly anklets just make your feet look so nice and delicate i also picked up this white padded shirt it has these two pads on the shoulders but honestly i'm not sure that i'm a huge fan of it because I don't know. I look like a football player. <laughs> but I do like that it's cropped and it cinches at the waist with this little elastic. I do like this shirt, but it sucks that this doesn't bring a little opening for me to take out the shoulder pads. Usually, bras bring a little opening so that you can take it out if you don't like it, but not this shirt. So I don't know what I'm going to do because I do like the shirt. I just don't like the shoulders. And I also got these linen pants the quality of these pants is amazing honestly really good quality pants i'm also going to bring this to peru i just also love the fit of these it's not really tight they're really flowy and comfortable really classy you can dress them up or down and my favorite things are these two tops i'm not bringing these to peru these are probably going to be shirts that i wear like over the holidays it's holiday season so I'm sure there will be some festivities and holiday parties that I'll be attending. So I saw these two tops and I'm like, these look so cute. So I got this olive one. It has gold as well. And it's just a beautiful open back shirt and it ties right at the waist in the back. And it has a really cute bow detail. I love how the bow falls once you tie it. Anyways, really love it. I can't wait to wear it sometime this year before the year is out and then this one also love it the print the color the design the cut everything this shirt is beautiful this one comes all the way up to the neck and you just button it right at the neck here and then you tie it back here as well and it has a long bow after you tie it and it's just a gorgeous gorgeous shirt love both of these and i can't wait to wear them also yesterday i stopped by sephora to pick up some items that i wanted to bring like travel size items y'all i spent way too much money at sephora on these like small little items but such is life i picked up a few items that i was in need of like this beauty blender i got the black one this time i have the pink one but i've been using my other beauty blender for more than three months and i think you're supposed to change them every three months so it was time so i got this one i think this is the pro something like that i don't know can't remember yeah this is the beauty blender pro and i got this take the day off cleansing balm by clinique so that i can just take my makeup off it's travel size and i no longer use makeup wipes if you're using makeup wipes what are you really doing just think it's wasteful and it's not kind for the planet so this cleansing balm is like an oil cleanser type of vibe and you just massage it into your skin and then rinse it off with water oh shoot hello oh jess are you home? hey hey yeah i'm home hey. oh i can bring it up to you if you want yeah oh is zoe here yeah, I think you want to bring her, come outside and see her. Then you can I want to see her. <laughs> <laughs> but you can't. You can come now. Okay, coming. <laughs> I also got this beauty blender cleanser. I usually clean my beauty blender with like this soap, which is probably not good. And that's probably why mine has been slowly like falling apart low key. But hopefully this will be better for it. And I got my favorite moisturizer. This is the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream, also in travel size. This is less than an ounce, but honestly, you don't need a lot of this. A little bit goes a long way, and this just really hydrates your skin. I also got this brow pomade by Merit. I love it. I don't know if you can tell, but I have some on. They actually sent me a PR package earlier this year, a few months ago, and I love it. So I saw it at Sephora and I'm like, I'm buying it. Um, I also really like their mascara. And then lastly, I got Gucci Guilty again because I freaking love this scent. Eau de Parfum. Love this scent so much. Yeah, th those are all the things that I got, y'all. But anyways, let us head out to finish the rest of our errands.
my lips look so ashy. <laughs> I'm back home. I picked up a few things from Target. Melatonin gummies. I usually travel with these. I also got some disposable face masks. These are just single use face masks. I like having disposable ones. And I picked up some travel size toothpaste because all of the toothpaste I have here is like very large and it exceeds the 3.4 ounces that TSA allows you to take out so I basically just put all of my products into tiny sized containers but with toothpaste it's difficult to like I don't know put into those kind of bottles so I needed some toothpaste even though I have plenty of larger bottles at home and I also got some gum I love traveling with gum fun fact <laughs> I'm always chewing gum y'all I saved the best for last I picked up my drone i finally got a drone i am so excited i'm gonna do an unboxing of it i have no idea what's inside of what it looks like even though i did a ton of research on this drone i've been watching reviews on it for a long time and also looking at youtube videos about it as well i'm gonna do a little unboxing and show you what's inside it's supposed to be really tiny which i am a fan of because that means it can fit anywhere and hopefully I won't have a lot of trouble with TSA and stuff I also picked up two SD cards one is for the drone and another one is for a GoPro because my friend Danny is bringing a GoPro on the trip and I'm using all of the footage she captures on that GoPro in my Peru vlog so it's gonna be fun <laughs> let's open this y'all um where can I place you y'all let's get to packing i'm a little bit conflicted because i don't know if i want to travel with my leather book bag or my michael kors bag usually this gets pretty packed as soon as i stuff my laptop in here and then i'm not able to fit that much stuff i think i'd be able to fit a lot more stuff in this bag but i know that i'll end up using this book bag more in peru i just like the ease and comfort of a book bag as opposed to like this open bag oh but this does have a zipper Oh, no, I think ugh, I don't know. I'm gonna jam my stuff into both of them and see what fits best. close out this vlog here thank you so much for watching and getting ready with me for my trip to peru make sure to stay tuned for my peru vlog that's gonna be very fun i'm so excited thank you for watching and i'll see you in my next video